Okay, so we've got a bit of an odd video coming up today. It's a mix of things that I'm going to be doing. Um, first of all, that door card over there is getting changed to leather. But first, I'm going to change this aerial for a small shark fin. Uh, once I've done that and put that back together, get that door card over there, change to leather, put that back in, put the seats back, and then this is getting a full valley, because it's a bit dirty, I mean it doesn't look it on the camera I don't think, but yeah it's looking pretty mucky. So, I'm going to give this a full valley, and then mine needs a full valley. Stay tuned. Okay, so I've tried to take a little bit of a shortcut to take the roof liner off the loop out after undoing all of these all around this one and that one, whatever. You've got to get to the back, and there's two slots here when you're putting it back in. Them two slots have got to go in first for the rest of it to hold in sort of tight. Now, what I've done, because I can't be bothered taking all the rest of it down, I've managed to pull it and get the two slots out. So now what I can do, is pull it down a little bit more and get in there. don't know if you can see that. But anyway, yeah, get in there and I can just about undo the aerial doing it that way and then I'll be able to put the new one in, tighten it back up again and then poke these slots back in and then that's that job done with a little bit of a shortcut. I've got my trusty apprentice um, doing typical apprentice stuff, just sat on his backside. Right, stay tuned and we'll get the new aerial fitted and then I've got to then Take that door card off, cover it in leather, like this one, and this one, and that one, and then clip it back in. Once I've done that, we're then going to give this a good wash and polish, and then clean up the inside, and then do mine. Oh yeah. Stay tuned. Might be a long day. I think I so I need to undo that bolt there. And I need to find out how far the wire goes through before you hit the connector for the aerial so I can connect the new one on. So oh, let's have a look. Please fit. Yes. Right, bit tight this, I'm going to have to pause up a sec. Okay, so um got that with bleeding seized on that, so I've come off for a while there. So I took that off. I've exposed this. <laughs> now I'm gonna get off. <laughs> get the twist on. Is it yeah it is right, so there's the old one gone. Now the reason I'm taking this off is because it's got no seal on it. Um we think there's a little bit of rain getting inside the car here and there. So, to take it off, you might as well upgrade it completely. Uh, bear with me and I need to bump it to the bar. Obviously we're going from the old fashioned long aerial to a shark fin. <sighs> Right, actually, before we do that, you're supposed to clean the area on the display screen. 
to it. Completely clean. And then, strictly speaking, you're supposed to clean the inside as well to make sure that there's no debris or anything like that to stop you from making a good connection. Right, here's the new one then. Let's see what this looks like. This is going to look here, Do us a favour, go around and push down on that. You can pull that over, whatever if you want to. Right, I'm going to slightly loosen it off. Turn the front of it towards the left side of the car. Done. Right, hold that there. I see a bit more. Screw in. Yeah. And that's going to go in there and then it clips into a little. I'm going to make a bit of cover it up, isn't it? The bleeding point of this is. I've ripped it. Nice. Right, and then that goes in there and there's a little pocket thing that it sits in to stop it from rattling around, which I'm guessing protects it from, I don't know, the wire breaking or something. Right. That's the thing yet. I'm checking that I've not creased the recline. Yeah, I have a bit. <laughs> no, she's not going to be happy. <laughs> That's not too bad. Right. Shut this boot and let's have a look what it looks like compared to the way it was. So, so much more character, wasn't it? Better looking at it. And some people will say, Oh, yeah, but you might not get it with a signal, but apparently you do. Well, we'll try that in a minute, first of all. Uh, let's get the new door card done. Go ahead. Oh, I just snapped a clip. Someone's going to say to me, you should be using a pry and seal, yes I know that, but I don't know where they've gone. <laughs> right, come on. No, there's another one. Now see, last time I've done this, I was putting everything back, I was on my own, and I slipped my finger open, so that was good time. Anyway. So we'll disconnect it, get it in the open. Get the leather done, how many? One, two, three, right there. That one's okay. One, two, three, five. Oh no, that one's not too bad actually. Oh yeah, it is, I just broke it. That's nice. Right, it's okay. Now, ignore that. Let's just go in and get this job done and then we'll have to take these broken ones off and replace them with what we've got. Right. Okay. I can't remember what 
så blir det lite. Ja. Åh, skit. Se. Se, last time, when it's on the passenger side one, I kind of forced that off and snapped it and I had to super glue it back on. So I don't want to do the same again if you get what I mean. You know, taking that off is nice and easy, just push it. Uh, that's another job I've got to do, actually. Oh, this is I'm using is contact adhesive. Make sure the end is nice and strong. Um, I recommend there yeah, not to do that. Uh, um, it says wait for three to four minutes after spraying it to allow it to go sticky. Um, once it's become sticky, then just pose the press it into position and then sort of hold it there to allow it to contact and then grab. So, gotta wait for four minutes now, let that do its thing, get it all sticky, and, and then we'll go from there. Go ahead. Now, see, that's the other thing that's missing this time around. I mean, I'm not going to tell Rosie, but she's probably going to watch this anyway, like, but when I did the other one, I didn't have you know, the clamps that you use to sort of seal it into position. I didn't know where they was, and I still don't know where they are now. <laughs> so I used um, Rosie's hair clamp. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's done the job, right? It's done the job. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to wait for this to sort of grip. And then we have start on the leather then. No, we won't, we won't. Once this is gripped, I've got to take this, this, and the door handle off. Then we'll do like that. Be good time. Is this sticky? It starts to grip that, that's getting on me now. <laughs> Very sticky there, though. Come on. I think we've all had times like that in the online. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! <laughs> right. Get the air dryer out. <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to say that that's stuck now. Um, I need to figure out how to get that off. See, half the stuff that I use to do the other side is gone missing. I had many things and they're all gone. Uh, right, okay, we're going to pause up here while we dig some tools. Yeah, so I got it off using some screwdrivers to slowly pry the uh, plastic out and then I just push down. So that, that's good. That's gone. So here's me a... Uh, Door handle. Now I've got to get this one out now. Like so. Mm. I don't want that to show when I put the leather on. It might not do, but we'll see. Hey Leo. <laughs> hey lad! You got to stack loose, not that sticky. Hang on, hang on. Nobody move. I need some sticky stuff to move it. Hey, oh, is your daddy? <laughs> or possibly some. Always that possibility that I'm going to run out of memory or glue or uh, patience. Or battery. Or, or, or battery, yeah, they haven't charged my phone. I need to get myself a GoPro or something, really. Or daylight. Oh, oh, oh. No, but we've got to have floodlights for that. <laughs> <Ready>? Go! <laughs> okay, so. You're lucky, mate, go. Nah. 
Ja, dat is een beetje 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 een Which way up is that now? That's the door handle. That goes that way. Yeah, that's right, isn't it? Okay, well, I'll do it this way instead. I'm going to have that round up for where, for where the uh, door switch goes. Hmm. That doesn't sit in the way. I guess that's the right way. Yeah, they have. You wouldn't think they've done this before, would you? No. So they have up to the owner already. That's all right, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Still something not right. That way. That's okay. Ah, okay, it's alright. That's really that one. As long as I know how it goes, it's okay. I'm going to take that back off now. Yep, yeah, getting her on the carpet. That's nice. I was going to say, you don't need that much. But you know what, I'm doing it anyway. trained in the art of making things stick. But I don't mind that one job. I mean the last one came out really well, which tells me that this one's gonna come out bad. As it already is. Push and stretch and pull and all that. That's not right, but I fixed that because I have to do the same on the other one. Nope. Okay, this isn't going well. That's what I'm just saying. Right, what I'm going to do is start there like I did on the last one. Once that's pushed into place.
well better. Fucking as an hour started. Yeah. And that's what I'm not happy about. The place that we bought it from, I haven't trimmed it properly because certain places it's not fitting. Yeah. Then again, I'm going to get it wrong. Should that be further that way? that over there if that see how this ends a little bit on the short side I'm gonna go do that first this the empty one yep oh it's alright fix it it's all good Probably not going to go as well as the other side did, but probably doesn't matter as long as it's on there. Never ever get it perfect the second time. I'm not happy about that bit either. Oh, we've got two tins left. This isn't going well. Some bits will probably need trimming as well. The last time I done this bit on the other door. Yeah, that's a Thank <laughs> you. 
Once I've done here, I've got to do that at last. I need to cut this out. I need to cut that out. And then that bit as well for the door. That's right. <sighs> Thank Right, I'm approved by that. Uh, if anything, I've not done it quite as well because it's a little bit messy. And glue everywhere. Okay, 
Let me handle. Let me could do this the right way up this time because last time I put it upside down. Just nearly snap the clip. See, I had this problem last time, it's just not going to go. Okay, so all glued up, all the trim is put back on. Now, I just thought I'd do a quick um, description because you might notice that some of the clips are different. Um, see, they're original OEMs, as you can see, because they've got the tarry glue crap stuff on. These white ones are the cheap rip off ones off eBay, but they break pretty quickly. And these grey ones are yeah, uh, original ones that are off a Skoda. But obviously they fit in a Volkswagen as well. They're very good, these ones. Pretty strong. So that's the most important or awkward part. Just getting <laughs> the pipe thing to go in the hole. Yeah. Good one. <laughs> oh, the clutch just fell off. Yeah, they've been the damaged ones, right? Okay. This isn't gonna go. <laughs> Where's that clip come from? Ah. Yeah. Ah, there's clips falling everywhere. Yeah, I think that one's just snapped off. Ah. Oh. Right. I don't know how that is. Right, I'm just going to leave that to dry and just see how it goes. I've got to take it back off, I've got to take it back off. Uh, yeah, it looks alright. That one's in. Leave that to dry. Good Right. 
Okie dokie. Well, um, so, where do I start? Um, so basically, the leather, what we were going to fit, is now done. It took a long time to get it done. Oh yeah, it's done. This has stayed nice. I thought the ba the original badge underneath there was all scratched and dull, and got this one off eBay for something like a pound and just stuck it on. It looks really nice. Uh, yeah, that's done anyway. Then, considering it didn't come out as nice as the passenger side, it has actually come out okay. I mean, there's little bits here where it hasn't pulled very tight, but it's not so bad. This did come off before because the glue weren't dry, but I think it's now dry because it's solid. Um, and we're gonna go and give the car a full valet now, and then give mine a full valet. Was gonna video it, but this video, by the looks of it, is already over forty minutes long, and I don't want to bore you too much. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna leave it here, and then. Um, Oh yeah, we fixed this as well. Oh, that's better. But yeah, I'm going to leave this one here. Um, as I say, spread the word. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And hit that little bell icon so that you just get notifications every time a new video is uploaded. Uh, see you in a, another video. Bye.